This method can help answer key question about voltage control over current in zinc oxide-based heterojunction field effect transistors with two-dimensional electron gas using short key contacts. The main advantage of this technique is that the gate of the field effect transistor can be defined in one photodiscrete step. The implications of this technique extend towards new generations of high-frequency, high-power field effect transistors by taking advantage of high electron saturation velocity in zinc oxide. Though this method provides insight into the nature of short key contact instability on zinc oxide, it can also be applied to other zinc oxide-based devices, such as sonar blend detectors and chemical or biosensors. To begin the procedure, load a sapphire substrate 2 inch in diameter, 380 micrometers thick C plane into a metal organic CVD instrument and prepare the system for deposition. Once the system is ready, ramp the reactor pressure to 30 tors and the substrate temperature to 1055 degrees Celsius in a hydrogen atmosphere over the course of 35 minutes. Hold it at that temperature for 3 minutes to desorb the residual contaminants. Then. Ramp the substrate down to 941 degrees Celsius over the course of 3 minutes. After letting the temperature stabilize for 2 minutes, set the trimethyl aluminum flow to 12.0 sccm and the ammonia flow to 7 sccm. Let the flow rate stabilize for 3 minutes. Then, switch the trimethyl aluminum flow to the run line to initiate the low temperature aluminum nitride.